Hey guys, I just bought the cheapest kayak that I could find on Amazon and it was the Intex, I forgot the name, forget it. It's link below if you wanna check it out in the description. Maybe an affiliate link, channels get commission when you buy it through them, blah, 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 all the legal stuff. Anyways, I got that kayak. I thought it was super fun to take it in the water and go fishing and all the stuff, but it's a paddle only kayak. I mean, I wanna fish. I wanna have my hands free. Dude, I wanna catch fish. That's what I wanna do. So what do, what do we do? What do we do? What do we do? I mean, it's not like I could just put a trolling motor on that or a torpedo is gonna, that prop is gonna probably hit the kayak and deflate it. What can I do? What can I? Oh shoot, to believe that I almost forgot. We got a Bisbee and the Bisbee goes anywhere. You could pretty much motorize anything with Bisbee. So this $75 kayak is not gonna be the exception. Now, we need to find the Bisbee. This garage is a mess, that's why I have this camera up. Look, it's up like that. I'm not gonna show you the garage because it's a mess. But we need to look for that Bisbee unit, see if it works. Let's go. Oh, dude, don't tell me you pre-set up everything for this video. See, <laughs> Alex, dude, I thought you were just gonna go through the garage and try to find what you need. Instead, you have everything here, right? Bisbee motor with the Mirage adapter. We got a battery. We got the kill switch somewhere around here. Where, where are you? There you go. Kill switch. We got two adapters. The Mirage, well, actually three adapters. This is a thin adapter, but see, this two is not gonna work. And this, how do you attach the Bisbee? Hmm, hmm, hmm. I guess we could disconnect this piece, but wait a second. Boom. Yes. This is the fin adapter, it's already set up. All you do is plug in the Bisbee here at the end of this cable. You just plug it in and slide it. Now, let's see if this works. Here it is, the Intex. Now, look at this. This is what we're talking about. We got the Fina Doctor here, we got the Bisbee. First thing you gotta do is connect this cable to the motor. Match it there, you see that there? Hopefully it's capturing. If not, I'm gonna show you a close up of that. And you gotta match the connectors. You got two males there and Two over here, female, Let's plug it in and then just twist it. There you go. Now, second part is once you connect the cable, is connect this. Oops. <gasps> plug in the BSP like you normally would. There you go. Connect the second brackets right here. All we have to do now is Take the old thing out and put this one in. All right, let's do that. Push it down and out it goes. Motor is looking that way. Just, oh, 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 problem here. It does not fit. It does not fit. But what can we do? I got it, I got it, I think I got it. You see this? I think we could definitely remove this piece, taking out those bolts, drill four holes in here, connect this piece, you remove this, drill four hole, this piece will go in here and there you have it. It's gonna look like this. And when I'm not using the Bisbee, this piece is just gonna have four holes. Will it work? Only one way to find out. Let's go, let's get it done. Okay guys, we are gonna go ahead and put this Bisbee motor right there on that inflatable boat. And now we're gonna do it using the Bisbee DIY kit. Basically, you get this bracket right here. You remove this and then you can install pretty much the Bisbee on any rudder that you could drill into. So let's go. Now, I loosened these bolts earlier. They're not as easy to lose, you know. <laughs> they wanna just loose like that on the water, you know what I mean? I'm not gonna get loose like that. 
boom so we got them out out now let's see how this looks over here all right hmm okay i'm liking it right here let me see if i get enough depth let's just put it here all right so it's connected right there i see some movement here this is like gravity is pulling down once it's on the water it should not be doing this so pointing up like that i don't think it's the best thing it has to be as parallel as possible so i'm thinking right here actually here at the end this is the best place to do it here at the end of time all right so now what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna just drill here 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 with a fine bit and then make the hole bigger when i have the beast be out but let's go here's one hold that there and do hole number two Hole number three. Hole number four. And screws goes in here. This taking like 10 minutes. It's gonna be an edit of two seconds like this. Okay, I think we got it guys. I think we're done with this modification here not gonna go anywhere it's not the perfect fit right here because the plastic is very thin as you can see there but it's a strong connection I don't think it's gonna be a problem only one way to find out tomorrow on the water now let's see how it looks when we attach it to the inflatable boat the Intex K1 I forget the name guys K1 this is the uh, single person installation of this baby right here it's gonna sl slide through here like so and it's gonna connect now again it's heavy on top but once this thing is on the water it should not wobble like this once it's on the water it should just go straight down because gravity oh, oh, oh. this is gonna be either a giant success or a big messed up can't wait until tomorrow. Let's do it. Boom. Let me see. Let me let me bring tomorrow. Oh, yeah. Yay! Bring in the start of the show. Which is gonna be mine. Okay. Let's engage the beast bee using the kill switch in here. Let's go. Oh, I have this wrong. Ah, something didn't work. Okay, uh, something is not working here. Hold there the paddle. I'm gonna have to get on the water. Not a problem. Uh, no, move it, move it out. Turn it and then go forward. <laughs> yeah, get us out of here. Uh, take us, take us somewhere safe. Right. Turn around. Give it more speed. Hey, look at this, guys. We are getting towed by the autopilot. Okay, I think I'm gonna jump in here. I'm gonna see if um, it's safe. This is like five feet. Yeah. Daddy's standing up. Oh my god, this thing is. Look at this. It was poor thing. This is uh, the mother of all grass. <laughs> all right. Okay, time to get back on the horse. Oof, you should film this. Here. Yeah. Oh boy. Oh. 
Alright, give me the hat. Okay, let's just get out of here. Uh, Hit the motor at maximum speed. Turn left. Woo! We've been towed. Okay, I think uh think I'm good. Gonna let you guys go. This is maximum speed, guys. I'm still with the paddle. This is fun. 20 minutes? Oh my god. Maximum speed. Still with the paddle. Shut up. This is fun, it does work! <laughs> Beast before the wind! Sorry. Hard to paddle it, I mean steer and hold a camera. <laughs> Let's go this way! Let's go to that thing that you see over there. Maximum speed! Ooh, this is so much fun, look at that! It keeps turning me that way. I need to find, I need to do like a DIY rudder setup. Right now I'm just like using one hand to steer, holding the paddle down like this. But this is fun guys, this is fun. I'm liking this, I'm liking this. Is that maximum speed? And what's the speed? 1.8. Okay, uh, go. So I'm going really slow then. I think it's I'm gonna jump in here to clean the clean the motor again. Uh oh, I lost the chain cleaner. Will it go up? I found the chain cleaner. Oh thank goodness. Oops. Hey, I'm gonna sit in there, you know. Alright, it's clean now. I'm gonna try to get on the boat again, but I'm peeing. I'm gonna pee. Yeah, thank you. Okay, it's should I hold it? Oh boy. <laughs> Andres, aguantate. Andres, aguantate. Oh. Moving on. You hold on tight. I don't know how to do it without. I should practice how to do it. Mira, todo el agua. All the water is in it. Okay. I know. We need a bilge pump. That's a bilge pump. To get the water out. Well, that can be right. Huh? Okay, so All that water came because I jumped in with the water. Ah, crash! Oh my god, this thing is flying! Oh, I could steer moving! I can't believe this! 3.65 3.6 So we go to maximum speed! This is so much fun, look at this! <laughs> I'm turning right here with one hand. Ooh I can't hear you. Let's go to the rescue. Ah, this is so much fun. We got the base beer right here using like the DIY adapter and boom, we're gonna hit each other. Now we want. Okay, 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 okay. Let's go over here. This green. Woo Woo Whoa. Hi, I cocked him. Andres, you want to jump in? Wait, 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 let me turn here. Ta -ta -ta -ta. Woo! 
What's up? Uh, yeah. This is too much fun. Oh, what if I fall over? Let's do that. I'm gonna fall over. I'm gonna fall over over here. Okay, let's see what happens. Okay, I'm gonna fall over. We did fall in, Andres. Okay, now let me get on it. It's almost. Do you need a way out? No. Uh, let me see. Oh, I think I think I got the water. Hold the bottle, Andres, to get the water out. Phone came out out of my pocket. <laughs> 